Hey everyone, Sarah here. Today I want to talk to you about the oils that I have as part of my natural first aid kit. And these are pretty much the oils that I would always travel with. So when it comes to traveling, I just wanted to share with you, you can buy little keychains like this, either from your back office or um, from some of the websites like Aroma Tools and things that have different colors. Um, and they actually come with, and this is a brand new one. I don't know if you can see. They come with little bottles that you can fill yourself with whatever oils that you want. So there's eight bottles in here. So perfect for um, traveling and not wanting to lug around um, a box with all your oils in. You can pop them in here. You can pre-dilute them if you want. Um, and then you've got them ready to go. So whether that's, you know, you want to use it just for your favorite um, natural perfumes, you can do that or your go-to oils. Whatever is the works for you, these are awesome. So um, I can pretty much guarantee that not no two people would have the same oils in their little keychain. So just a handy tip. And also, um, with your wholesale membership yeah. in your folder, looks like this, um, you would have had some brochures, but also had some cap stickers like this. So you can pop these onto the tops of these little bottles as well, as well as on your bottles like this. So it's really easy to see what they are, especially in a container like this. So back onto oils for my first aid kit. So the first one um, that I think everybody should have is Correct X. So this is an ointment um, with frankincense, helichrysum, cedarwood, tea tree and lavender oils. So it basically, it's just like a bit of a cream. Now I'm hoping you can see when that comes out and you just rub it on. So for all things skin, so um, for healing, cuts, grazes, um, bites and things, really great one to have on hand. The next one, oh, I love the smell of that, that I would suggest having is Ice Blue. Now this one is actually in a doTERRA touch bottle, which is already pre-diluted. So I love having these. Um, there's no fuss, I don't have to worry about making up my own, but basically I can just grab these and roll it. So if I've got any neck tension, I can just roll it on and um, massage that in. Um, to my neck or my shoulders. Um, really good also for um, period pain. So if you're on the go or you're traveling, a really handy one to have, especially you know if you're walking around a lot. Um, yeah, good one to have. On guard, obviously immune support. Everybody needs this in their first aid kit. So again, I've got the touch bottle, um, which I take out and about with me, really handy to have um, to roll on for um, you know, even if we're going on a, on a plane, a train, in a boat, wherever, and we're touching other things where there's germs, um, I've got this and we can just even simply roll it onto our hands and rub them together. Kids can do it too as a natural hand sanitizer. So yeah, if you're out and about feeling run down, great one to have and good to have in your first aid kit for the same reason. Easy air is a great one to have as part of your first aid kit. So rather than reaching for something like um, Vicks or something that may have some nasties in it, this one is great for your um, opening up your airways, easing congestion. And if you're traveling, a really good one to have, we use this all the time on the airplane, helps um, unblock our ears on takeoff and landing. And it's a really, really nice one to have just to help relax and um, open up your airways. All right, Digestin. This little guy is amazing for tummy upsets. Um, also any bloating, nausea, um, car sickness, motion sickness, a really great one to have. So I don't have this in the touch roller bottle, um, but I do have my own. And you can see it's very, very old. My little sticker is um, in much need of replacing. So this cap stickers are really great, not just for and putting on the tops of your bottles. But if you do make up your own blends and you've got a few different oils in, just pop the stickers along there. Um, so also this is really good um, yeah, for gastro constipation, diarrhea. So rather than having um, gastro stock or a medication for gastro, have that. Also heartburn, so you can get rid of all your heartburn medication and use um, your Digestin if that works for you. So um, I know for my husband, he has used um, Digestin to help um, with heartburn in the past. 
All right, what else have I got here? I have frankincense. So this is really, really good for cellular health. So it's really great to have on hand, um, pretty much for any, any situation. So if you're in doubt, get your frankincense out. Um, so really good for, um, as I said, boosting cellular health, but also things like inflammation. Um, so using that in combination with ice blue, um, in inflammation in your, in your body anyway, really good combo to have. All right. Peppermint. We all know this is so great for um, headaches. Um, also really good for regulating your temperature. So if someone in your house has got a high temperature, you can apply it to the soles of your feet, um, also down the spine, and it will help in reducing that temperature. Another one I heard of recently that one of um, my oils users used for her daughter, who's 12 months old, was lemongrass, and that got rid of the temperature within two days. So really good one to have um, as part of your um, first aid kit. You can also, I just want to highlight these little guys, the peppermint beadlets. So awesome for um, freshening breath, but also if you need to cool down, if you're feeling hot um, because of the weather or, or, you know, stressed and getting a bit worked up, I don't know if you can see that. This is the little peppermint beadlet so it's half a drop of essential oil in a in a beadlet and the other good thing about this is you can just pop it under your tongue um, to freshen your breath but you can also just pop it between hold up between your fingers and you can see probably oh, the light's not that great oh there you go you can see there's some oil in there so if you're um, feeling really hot you could just pop that in your hand and rub it on the back of your neck and you'll feel that cooling effect. Oh, amazing, love peppermint. Um, there also is on guard beadlets that do the same thing. So if you don't have your on guard roller or other bottle with you and you've got these in your bag, you can pop them under your tongue to help um, with immune support or do what I just did with the peppermint one and pop it in your hands, rub them together as your natural hand sanitizer. All right, what else have I got here? Last two, lavender and tea tree. We all know how amazing these are for skin, for bites, for um, cuts, grazes, tea tree for its antiseptic properties. So you can use this in place of other um, antiseptic creams and lotions that you may have had in your first aid kit. So again, these are the touch bottles. And like I said, you, you don't need to get these. Um, if you've just started out and you've got your kit, get yourself some roller bottles and you can make them up yourself with your coconut oil and then you've got them ready to go ready to roll on um, as you need and that's it that's all I have um, so that's what I have as part of what I call my natural first aid kit so it covers so many things from um, obviously the skin ones cuts grazes bites um, bruises we've got immune support digestive support things for heartburn um, cellular health inflammation headaches nausea um, yeah, so you, most of you will have these oils in your kit, so you'll be able to go and make up your own first aid kit after um, boot camp. So I hope you enjoyed that um, quick run through. Have a great day.